Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a House of CB first impressions haul. So I haven't actually ever tried House of CB before. They've recently gifted me some of their dresses from their new collection and I thought I'd talk through the quality, the price and how they fit as well. House of CB have always been a brand that I've wanted to try but they are also quite expensive so I kind of wanted to talk through whether I think that the pieces are worth the price now that I've actually tried them and yeah just give you guys my honest opinion of what I think. I believe their new collection for spring is called La Petale and I could be saying that so wrong but I think it's like La Petal like floral sort of prints. It's very like cottage core vibes perfect for spring, perfect for like garden parties, for lunches in spring and summer. So yeah, it's quite different to what I usually wear. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I don't have a specific aesthetic in that sense. I do like basic outfits. I also like mixing in more special occasion wear pieces, which I think these pieces are exactly that. I think if you're gonna shop from House of CB, it's obviously not an everyday sort of brand to shop from, unless you obviously have the money to shop there but I think these pieces that they've brought out and a lot of their collections are sort of like specific occasion wear pieces so I think these ones are all really lovely for birthday dresses wedding guest dresses and a lot of their collections do sort of feed into different occasion wear since this is my first haul that I'm filming I wasn't quite sure how to film it but I think I've decided that I'll talk through the pieces with you and then also show you how they fit on. So I've actually got all the pieces behind me lined up. I'm gonna start with the dresses. Overall, I got three dresses and one corset top. And the corset tops from House of CB, if you don't know, I think you need to get to know. I feel like the corset tops there are like the very best of the corset tops. So yeah, we're gonna get into it and I'll show you how all of them fit. Okay, so I'm going to start with this one. This is called the Lolita dress and I believe it is 169 pounds. This dress is quite far from what I usually wear, although I thought it was beautiful, the color of it and just the subtle sort of floral print on it. It's like a pale yellow. I don't know if you can see that well on the camera. It has a scoop neck, but it's also quite straight as well, which I find really flattering on myself being small chested. A lot of House of CB things are corseted, so that's what I really like about the brand, how it really accentuates your figure. I think these dresses, I'm not used to that style on me, but I actually loved how they look when I tried them on yesterday. So yeah, I really love this detailing here of the corset, but it's also not like a classic corset. It's kind of like a bodice there, and then it puffs out, and then you've got like a midi, length it's just very floaty and sort of like a classic summer dress i would say i think this would be perfect for a birthday lunch also as a holiday dress i could really see this in like greece or italy one thing to know about them is that they are quite thick i did expect them to be good quality for the price that you pay for these dresses but they are a lot thicker than I thought. So that's one thing to bear in mind. If you're wearing it on holiday, it is quite thick, so it could be a little bit warm. What I really like about this dress as well is that it's got the little straps. I think this adds a really delicate sort of detail to the dress and just makes it look super elegant. Another thing I will say about these dresses is that I do think they kind of run a little bit small. So I got all of the dresses in a size small and I'm a UK size eight to 10. I'm more of a UK eight, but some things I do like to size up. Saying that though, if I did get the medium, I do think it would have been a little bit too big. I am kind of just one of those people who is always in between sizes. So I think as long as you don't eat like a massive lunch in this, I think it would be perfect dress for any occasion really. It's this lovely pale yellow color, and then it's got darker yellow flowers on there and some green as well. I really think that this was something that my wardrobe was missing so yeah I'm really happy with this style and the best thing about this dress is that it's got pockets so I feel like that's such a nice addition to the dress and the design okay so the next dress that I picked up is this beautiful white dress I feel like it is just the ultimate white midi dress this is the front but I feel like the back is just like first of all it's screaming summer i just love how 
classy the dress is but then I love the addition of the backless detailing I just feel like this dress without the backless detailing wouldn't really be me but with that I think it just adds a little twist to the dress I love the sleeveless design I find that it's kind of a similar shape to the top I'm wearing right now again being small chested I think that these tops really suit me where they're kind of like a wide slash neckline yeah I really love that style and that is kind of what this neckline is and with the sleeveless design as well this again is a really tight bodice design and then it flares out into a lovely midi skirt when it comes to white dresses I always love to wear crisp white dresses i have a thing i think i've said it before about off white and white and i've had my colors done before they basically said that i am a i think it's called a sultry winter and that means that you should only really wear crisp white clothes so pure white is what sort of lights my face up and my skin tone rather than like an off white and like a cream or like a ecru sort of color so yeah this is perfect for me it is like a pure white which i just love and i think in summer with tan accessories i just think it is so so nice i believe this one retails at 179 pounds and again it is super good quality it is very thick as well so for holidays it might be a little too thick but depending on the temperature and everything but i just think this would be so beautiful in croatia or any hot country really i could really see this being such a lovely dress for dinner i think it is a beautifully designed dress and yeah the dramatic back is really what sold it to me so personally i would pair it with either this kind of bag or this one both of these are from mango and this printed one i just think it adds like a bit of a vintage vibe to the dress and i pair it with tan heels as well i think the black really adds like a classic timeless stamp to the dress the gold detailing i just think is perfect for if you're having a date night i think it just makes it super chic and wearable okay so the last dress that i picked up is this i believe it's called the carmen dress so you'll have probably seen this sort of style before from house of cb because they do it in so many prints and colors but it's a classic midi dress and then it has a split up the side and then it also has like the corset detailing on the back so i'll just bring it a little bit closer so you can see but it has the sort of tie up design which i just think is super feminine and pretty so this print is their newest design in the carmen dress and it's sort of like a really feminine rose petal design one thing i wasn't sure about with this style of dress is that it wasn't going to sort of fit my bust that well i actually do think that it is a really nice fit one thing to mention though is if you have a bigger bust than me these dresses do come in a bigger cup size i don't know if all of the dresses that i've shown do but this definitely does which i think is really really good because i think this is super flattering on a bigger bust and it just means that it fits everywhere else as well and it'll fit you perfectly so this dress has a little tie design here along with the lace up back there are also adjustable straps which is really useful i would say out of the three this dress was definitely the most snug fitting so if you're in between sizes for this one i would size up compared to the other two dresses i do think this one is more wearable for the daytime i think this would be really lovely on like a city break with some sandals or it would also be so nice as a wedding guest dress or if you have like a garden party to go to out of all the three dresses i think my favorite is the white one just because it is sort of more my style being timeless and chic and quite plain and I just love the silhouette of it I think it's really elegant and it's not something that I have in my wardrobe but I do really love both of the floral ones as well I think they're something a little bit different to my wardrobe and I think they're just a really nice option for a special occasion the last thing that I picked up from house of cb is this gorgeous corset this again is part of their new collection it's got this gorgeous white and floral print to it and it has sort of multicolored flowers on it i love the tie detailing at the top and then it is hook and eye closure all the way down when i actually unboxed this i thought it looked really wide and i was unsure that it was actually going to fit me again i picked this up in a small and for reference i'm a cup size i would say like b but yeah it just looked really wide and i was unsure it was going to fit but actually it is a perfect 
perfect fit and as you can see on the clip i've styled it with my abercrombie curve love jeans i just think it's such a gorgeous outfit for like a bottomless brunch it would also be really nice with some flat white plimsolls and like a trench coat just for like a spring daytime kind of outfit so i believe this one is called the chica top and this is 89 pounds i thought this would look really nice as well with some low-rise jeans i don't actually have any low-rise jeans in my current collection at the moment i also think it would look really nice with like a low-waisted maxi skirt especially a white maxi skirt i did actually film a reel yesterday wearing this top with my white zara skirt, but i just think this would look so nice with a long maxi skirt on holiday for just like the ultimate spring summer kind of vibe personally i don't wear a bra with this corset but you could definitely get away with sort of like a balconette bra underneath if you wanted some extra support but yeah, this one again comes in the bigger cup size, which I think is really useful for women with a bigger chest that want it to sort of hug themselves as well on their waist. Now I think about it, this could also look really nice with a pair of low-waisted linen trousers. Yeah, I think there's so many ways you can style this and I'm really excited to wear it during spring and summer. So that is all the pieces that I picked up from House of CB. And I just want to say thank you to House of CB for kindly gifting me them. My overall opinion of the brand and first impression is that I definitely think the pieces are such good quality. Not like any other brand that I've tried before in terms of occasion wear. I do think the quality is kind of like a step higher. If you've never shopped at the brand before as well, definitely check them out for occasion pieces. They have so many different collections and not all of them are sort of cottage core sort of aesthetic a lot of them are very sleek very minimal and very just sort of glamorous so i really like the versatility of the different collections at the brand but i do think this one is perfect for the summer and i really can't wait to wear the dresses out and about i don't have any holidays booked as of yet but i definitely will be taking them away with me when i do i'll link all the pieces that i've tried on in this video below and yeah i hope you've all enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up up and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any future videos thank you all for watching and i hope you've enjoyed and i'll catch you in the next video bye